welcome back. It's a brand spanking new year, 2017. I'm full of hope and excitement for what's to come this year. I was thinking back over the year that's just passed and where I was at the start of 2016 and where I was at the end of that year and how many things I had learned. And what I realized was that there were a number of goals I had set last year that I actually managed to achieve. So today's blog is on my morning routine. I wanted to share my morning routine with you. For years I've heard about the importance of having a structure to start off the day and also to end the day and being someone who thrives on variety, I've had a real problem with getting a morning routine going. But after a few months of trying and a lot of persistence, I have actually managed to establish a morning routine. So my morning routine uh, usually takes an hour and a half to two hours before I leave the house. And I start my morning off with meditation. I sit for at least 10 minutes and I use a timer. And the type of meditation can vary depending on my mood each morning. So I have allowed some variety within that framework. And then following my meditation, I do some kind of spiritually grounding practice. So I might smudge myself with sage or Palo Santo uh, or sweet grass. I may uh, read something that's grounding and I also have some, some shamanic animal cards that I like to use and that gives me a little bit of direction for the day. Following that, depending on my mood, I'll either get into my physio exercises that I need to do or I'll sit and write a gratitude list. I do try to do a gratitude list every morning and I have a, a, a fairly big notepad and I really try to put a lot of detail in that and that's part of that gratitude practice of being mindful and noticing uh, what's going on in my life. After I've done that it's usually been an hour so I call that my holy hour and then I'm in the shower getting ready uh, eating breakfast and then you know usually at around an hour and a half two hours I'm, I'm ready to head out of the house. So that's my morning routine. And one of my goals for 2017 is to establish a nighttime routine. I have not yet been able to get into a pattern of the time I go to sleep, the way I go to sleep, what I do before I go to sleep. I am all over the place and as a result my sleep is also all over the place. Here's your weekend throwdown. Is there one practice one regular practice that you could start this weekend something that you've been wanting to introduce to the start of your day or the end of your day something that helps you to be more grounded and present more productive more open and loving it makes you a better person what's that one thing that you could start doing and can you try it for each day of the weekend and continue it on for the following week